That should be all ready. And we're okay. So, uh, mom, how do you make this with ale? What's the first thing you you uh, you start with? Well, you start off <clears throat> with some boiling water to make a broth, which I use purified water in the bottles. It's very good for your cooking. Okay. And you add uh, depends how big of a pan you're going to use for your fideo. Uh, on this pot that I have here, I, I have about four bottles of water. Okay. Water. Okay. So I'm gonna uh, be chopping up some of this onion here. Onion? It's, it's a white onion. It's pretty strong, but it's... So you fill the bowl up pretty much like three quarters and you put onion? Yes. And you put the... Uh... We got onions and another very important thing is is the what leaf. the leaf the leaf bay leaves the bay leaves so how many bay leaves do you I put in put, like four I or have five two in there already so okay. I have about uh, three in here okay medium size if you can get them fresher sure. the better if you can get them fresher so. so okay we got onion we got bay leaves yes. and you've already got the chicken I see over there it's already diced up and I have turned it up because I wanted to get started the boiling it okay but I so I'm going to put in here some uh, breast that's been cut up in small eating, sure. right. eating sizes and we're going to cook it I would say about an hour okay. just to be sure. An hour? Uh, we'll cook it for an hour and that's making my okay. broth. You put all that meat in there? Um, I want to see how much the pan can take so it looks like it can take more yeah. oh that's right because when you put the fideo noodles it's gonna it's gonna fill it up okay so then you heat that and you boil it first so when the meat is fully cooked with the onions and the bay leaf then you put in the fideo uh yes what i'm gonna do like you just mentioned is boil it get it cooked Okay. And then, while I'm cooking it, I'm going to add some chili. Some chili. Which is a very mild chili. I see you got Hurtis. Yes, very Her nice brand. Hurtis chili. It's a famous brand. Yes. And you use medium. And this is medium. And as you don't have to cut up any more vegetables or ch chili because everything is in here. Okay, I see. But some people can use hot chili if they prefer it hotter. Oh, well, that's fine. So you, can, you, you recommend for them to be with medium chili? Yes. It's, so it's how much medium. do you put in? Half a, I half put, a bottle? I uh, uh, put about half a bottle of this small bottle. It's not a big bottle. Okay. But uh, see, I don't know exactly how many ounces okay. it is. Uh, 16 ounces. Okay. Half yeah. Of so you get a regular medium-sized small bottle. Put half of it right. in there. Okay. Okay, okay, so we're gonna <clears throat> we're gonna let this boil. How long does that take to boil? It'll probably be about an hour for the amount that I put in here. Okay, so we'll cut right now and we'll come back when that is ready. Sure. And you recommend putting the noodles in after it's done boiling? A little what? After it's done boiling, then you put in the noodles after it's been boiling an hour? Uh, you mean the noodles? No, not exactly. Uh, we'll have to work on the <clears throat> on the noodles. Okay, so when do you put the noodles in? Well, that'll be next. That's what I said. In an hour, when when and when yeah, it's when it's done. When everything is done cooking, the the chicken and and the uh, onion. Well, the, we're calling that when the broth is done. The broth is the onion. Okay, so one hour. Okay, chicken. we'll be back. Stay tuned, guys. Oh. Stay tuned, everybody. Cut the cameras. We are not ready to fry. She's going to continue making the fideo. She already boiled the chicken. And keep in mind when the chicken is boiling, remove the broth, the froth, the white froth that comes on the top of the chicken. Just like when you make any chicken soup, remove it so it's clear. Now you're putting the fideo on the pan. Frying pan. With some, with some olive oil. Okay. And what we're going to do is toast this. You're going to toast it a little bit? Toast is it that is that for color or This see? Okay. It, it looks like a little nest. It's yeah. round. This is the kind you But there was a noodle. 
that looks like a little bird nest. <laughs> what I call it. It's actually, the dish is actually called pedale. Yes. Okay. So now I'm going to toast these <clears throat> on both sides. Excuse me a minute. Okay. I'm going to have this handy. Okay. After they're toasted on both sides, I'm going to add the heritage chili. And okay. then I'm going to put the broth in here. Okay. Okay. Fill it all up. Okay. And I'll just let it cook till it's soft and it kind of take it apart. Now, what you're doing right now, how long does that take? Well, it depends how many you have and stuff. So. Okay. Yeah, maybe 15 minutes to brown. Some pans run hotter than others. Yeah. So, we'll do it like that. And there's been a little bit of salt. Yes. And pepper added to the broth. Okay. So I will not be putting it in here in the pan. Yeah. It comes out quite delicious. It's a nice family dish. It's good. Who did the lighting for this shot? Is it the Burbank Studios? Yes. Oh, okay. I just want to make sure. That was a quick interruption. Okay. So, you're okay. You're warming it. I see it's changing color underneath. This, it's, it's. Well, you get it's underneath, and well, it'll change. It's gonna turn. Brown. Okay. Underneath, it'll stuff cooks pretty good. And you cook it on medium heat or low heat. I would say medium. To me, it looks like it's burning on the bottom. Is it burning? Because it looks. Yeah, burning. so you, you will burn some of it like yeah, this. Uh, but that's okay. Uh, it's okay to burn a it little is, bit. It, it is. I call it toasty, and uh, it gives uh, the. Because once it cooks and it's all done, that brown part yeah, will it be. In it'll be just as tasty as a as a lighter noodle. Yes. Okay, so now you're turning all the. The fideo. You're turning them all over? Yeah, I'm turning them over now. And you'll see some that are real toasted already. But, okay. But that makes it taste better. Yeah. Yeah, but if you toast it. There. Okay, we turned them over. And if you, I don't know if you can see good. Yeah. But uh, some of them are more toasted than others. Okay. I can see everything's coming along. Everything's coming along. And there's the chicken soup over there by the refrigerator, kind of steaming. Now I'm going to get like half a bottle of the Herodis. Now you're going to add more Herodis jelly? Are you going to add it onto the noodles? Yes. Okay. I'll lower this because I don't want it to splatter all over. So you're actually having it on low heat? Okay, so then you scoop, you scoop the soup into it little by little? Yeah, the broth. You put it in there with your chicken. Your little phone little. is in the middle of the camera shot. And um, you're getting in the camera. Oh, oh, oh. All right. Cook around. Oh, so you scoop the chicken and everything. That's it. Put the chicken. In there. So you kind of stir it around, mix it around. Yeah. You don't have to let it lay on top. You can turn it over yeah. also. Yeah. But you already turned it over already. It's okay. Doesn't matter. <clears throat> I'm trying to get the chili down at the yeah. bottom. <clears throat> so you just kind of play around with it? Yeah. <coughs> oh, the air conditioning is on because of all the lighting. That's why I'll, I'll, we'll turn off the electricity in a minute. The sound stage is freezing in here. Oh, Kimberly, mm. Laura, who turned on the air conditioner? Who was it? Who was it? The AC? Me. Oh, uh, I, I don't know. Was it Mark or Mom? Mark, Mark. Oh, tell him not to turn it on. Because it, it, it heats up the whole sound. It, either heater or, or air conditioner, it'll get the whole sound stage. When you're filming at Family Matters at Laura Mar, it was like... Eight thousand a week, the electric bill. Oh, okay. 
So that's... I'm adding more broth because it needs a little more moisture. Not so much chicken anymore, but yeah. broth. Yeah, yeah. And because it, it, it'll cover it all up. Oh, okay. Remember my mom always used to give it a blessing that it turns out okay. And you know what? We always had good yeah. luck. <laughs> Why do you guys have four cameras rolling on this? You only need two. Like an extra? We have Back four up. customers. We have extra. Oh, I see. That, that makes sense. And are sense. interested in That makes sense. Okay. So, <laughs> it's coming together there. Oh, yeah. So, you just keep on filling yeah, it up? Uh, what you do is just keep, uh, you know. How come you don't just put all the chicken in there? Because I don't want all the chicken in there. I think it's too much. If you want more chicken, you add more chicken. You okay. want more chicken no, in No, no. I'll eat anything. I'm not picky. <laughs> well, this isn't anything. This is fideo. It's special. Okay. So I'm just playing around with it to kind of... Okay, so how much playing do you got to do before it's... Until it comes loose like this. So okay. the pepper... How about the pepper? Yeah, you know, it just kind of... So like, you keep playing with the noodle until it kind of loosens up? Yeah, it loosens up. <laughs> and then when it's, uh, when it's almost done cooking and everything's blended okay, you put a little bit of cheese on top. A little shredded cheese I have right here. Oh, on top a little bit? That means you're finished and you just when sprinkle it. So you, you, you put the cheese towards the end? Yes, throw away it. This yet. dish, I've seen people go crazy over this dish, and I'm, you know, I'm wondering, like, I gotta make a video because people keep asking for it, and they don't usually serve this in Mexican restaurants. It's a Mexican dish, but they don't serve it in most Mexican restaurants. It's a family tradition thing. Yeah, it's more of a family dish. It's like the best thing I ever ate. <laughs> Besides lobster thermidor. Oh gosh, that is a good dish. It That's takes a good. patience to get it all done. But yeah. The more it cooks, the easier. That's that. And you're gonna keep uh, eating. You're gonna what? <laughs> okay. Oh, can you open it? Let's kill me. You know that Kodak Panavision. That stuff's expensive. We cost a fortune on the other, on the other roll. And look at what I have right here. You got about eight livestock rolls of. Okay. Yeah, we got a dog down there. Same Honey, come here. Same little guy. That's the producer's little dog, isn't it? That's that's Barney. 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 That's, that, that's the that's the boss around here. That's, that's uh, the boss. Hey. That's Barney B. That's Barney B. Yeah. He always hangs around the set, goes in the offices and everything. Bessie Bucking. Everybody grandma. feeds him and gives him goodies. <laughs> He's a cute little dog. Okay, so then. Yeah, you just keep doing this. Until, again. okay, so then when it's almost ready, you just add the cheese? Mm -hmm. When it is ready, you add the cheese. So just to let it cook right now is what I'm letting it do. Oh, but, delicious. But uh, sometimes these little nests. Would you get away from this? She keeps knocking over the camera. <laughs> the camera assistant's banging on all the cameras. That editing's like $1,200 a minute. But, um... Oh, that looks really good. Little by little, it's taking the form. Because they, they do a voiceover in like seven different languages, and it comes out really good. This, yeah, I can see it's coming together. Yeah, it is. Anyway, let me get a clean spoon, give it a taste. Mm -hmm. Hold on. So, pretty much. Pretty much done now, and I just want to be sure that it. You taste it? Perfect. When grandma cooks, you know it's good food. Yeah, it's, it's perfect. The flavors are perfect. If I wanted to, I could add more salsa. Yeah. But sometimes people like to add it themselves. You know, how much they want, how hot they want it. You know, the Mario comes on the, uh, the catering trucks on the... <laughs> Uh, at the studio, and they have these chimichanga burritos uh -huh. that are like crispy. Those things are so good. Oh, man. Yeah. Some of them. Yeah, especially on location when they're filming. Everybody wants those, but with a Coke. They don't okay. get better than that. Yeah. 
And it's not expensive food either, you know. Doesn't have to be too tasty. In yeah. fact, some of these dishes, like this dish here, is very economical for families and everybody. And yeah. they all love it, no matter yeah. what age. Okay, there okay. it is. Here okay, goes. so then you're gonna put more cheese. Yeah, I'm gonna put the first. And then you're gonna let it cook until all the noodles are done, like kind of like spaghetti. Yeah, exactly. That's pretty good. I heard that when you let it sit a while, even when you turn it off, it kind of thickens. Is yeah, that true? Yeah, it does. Uh -huh, because of the so there you go, everybody. That's video. Subscribe uh, to the cooking channel. Like this is what, and comment down below. Yeah, this is what they serve on the. TV shows, we always give it to our staff and cast, and they go berserk. <laughs> they like it. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, thank you for joining us, Miss Kimberly. Thank you for sharing. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Kimberly's welcome. over there. And I put a lid on it just to let it. Okay, see. so what would you say? Let it warm all along. You just leave it like that so the cheese. So it's ready to eat in about 15 more minutes? Yeah, I would say so. There you go, everybody. Over and out. That's for the Joy. Joy. Okay. Barney B. Okay. Over and out.